Jones. I don't kill you right now. Not a very bad place, but I uh... Where do the children come from? Uh, well, they all come from Magilov region. That's, uh, Magilov is a, quite a big town in Belarus. And so uh, all of the children come from surrounding villages. <laughs> Could you explain Chernobyl, what actually happened? Um, and when it happened? Well, it happened in 1986. Mm -hmm. And um, there was a very big nuclear, pl nuclear plant. And it exploded. And the, um, the radiation went all over the place, and the wind was the wind was blowing in direction of Belarus. Uh, Chernobyl is in, in the Ukraine, but the wind was blowing towards Belarus, and so uh, all the radiation fell on fell, fell on the territory of Belarus, and so many children got affected by by it. And well, they developed all kinds of diseases like thyroid cancer and blood cancer, leukemia, and so most of the children are very ill, and it affected them uh, very much. What ages are the children that are here? Well, uh, the children are fr uh, from 8 to 12, uh -huh. uh, but it really affected their parents, and that's why the children were born with all these diseases. But the consequences of this catastrophe, we will all, we will only get rid of them maybe in 50 years, because still the children are being born with different diseases and different handicaps because of that. So the children that are here, their own children, and possibly their own grandchildren, yeah. will be affected by yep. this as well? That's right. From being here for maybe a week or two, how would that help their, their own health? Well, that, would help, uh, that will help them greatly because they have some proper food. Uh, because where they live, they don't have proper food. All the food is polluted by radiation. And here they'll get some good water and fresh air. And that will improve their health greatly. Just uh, uh, their, organism will, uh, their organisms will clean. They've already been here for about four days, and they, uh, they've changed greatly their complexion, their, their color, their, their skin, and just they, they, they become much better. In my church where, where I am a pastor, it is written that God is love. And uh, when I came here, I was quite surprised not to see this message on your wall. But during these days while we've been here, I found something else, something different. Я нашел то, что слова Бог есть любовь написаны в сердце каждого из вас. 
I realized that these words, God is love, are written in the heart of each of you. Do you have anything to say to the, the families who have been lucky enough to have yourselves and the children as guests? Well, uh, I just want to say thank you and we're privileged to be here and it's just, just really great. What they're doing is absolutely fantastic and they've done so much for us and for the children and that's just, I just want to say thank you once again. And we all are very grateful to them.